Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Goes Sweden. Today it's time for the reaction of Slovenia, but before we go there, I will talk about my daily life as always. So if you're just interested in my reaction, check out the timestamp because there you can skip forward. Okay, so what happened today? Well, it is a Friday for me, so of course everyone at work was already like, oh, finally weekend and actually I can say that all the side quests that were popping up this week were finally completed today. So next week is a new refocus back on my own projects and hopefully I can get yeah a lot of them done in the next week as well. Unfortunately, we only have four days of work there, but I think in those four days it's going to be possible to finish at least all the things that I have right now in my head set to be finished. Yeah, but besides that, it was not the nicest weather today. It was actually snowing when I went home, but then it turned into rain. And I don't even know if it's raining right now, but it is really foggy. So let's see how it's going to be over the weekend, if it's freezing again or if it's yeah heating up. I just really hope now it's, it's, it's enough winter. So really we can start slowly, go into warmer temperatures now. Because at least in the morning hours when I always I want to have less clothing on. So I'm looking forward for warmer things. And when I got home, I have seen that I got some mail. I think now all my um, health insurance things in Sweden are fully completed, at least based on the, the insurance. Because I have received my European health insurance card. I was a bit surprised when I like already felt it in the envelope and I was like, okay, it has to be this one. But how did they get a picture of me? But in the end, there is no picture of anyone on these health insurance cards. I'm really interested to try it out in the future. Yeah, but I don't know how that is supposed to work. I think I will try it out in Germany once <laughs> just to yeah get the experience. Maybe also to just tell the European people here, if it really works, at least in Germany, and how they are reacting to things like that. But besides that, it really was a very lazy day after work. I actually felt really tired. <sighs> Just talking about sleeping already makes me tired again. But yeah, so with that said, it is now time to move into the reaction for today, which is the song from Slovenia. Hey guys, I'm LJ and today I will be reacting to Raven with her song Revronica, which is the Slovenian participant for the Eurovision Song Contest 2024. I am watching the live version and this is the first time watching her singing live. I have listened to the song on Spotify already many times and also have seen the music video, but not the live performance. So this is something new. And I really hope that she is capable to keep the good song also on the live stage. But as always, first watching, then my opinion. And in the end, I will give my points to rank her in all of the songs. Okay, this is a bit different. There's a keyboard guy. In the beginning I thought she is naked and she just has like leaves on there, but I think this is like a full body suit. But it confused me a bit. Okay, I don't know if this is actually the way she is performing on the grand stage because this is very different to the music video because there is no background noises and voices going on. Maybe this is not the correct thing, but still good to see her performing. performing.
DC Veronica Okay, you have to be capable to sing those high notes. Ooh. Okay, Raven Veronica live from Dora 2024. I am really, really curious if she is performing like this in Malmö or if she's trying to get more of the music video on stage. Because those those are two different um, songs, in my opinion, like two different versions of the song. They are very different. This is more like an acoustic version that I've just listened to, which I still think is very nice listening to. But I don't think um, this performance is better than the one in the music video. So I love the background and the like more than one voice. But uh, I don't have... We will see how it goes. Maybe she has like made a decision to go for that. But the question now for me is will I point like do I give the points to the live performance that I have that we have seen or will I give the points to the music video? I think I will take the average to be honest of both of them. So for the live performance I would give 7 points. And for the music video, I would give 8 points. So we meet up in the middle at 7.5. However, now that I've listened to so many songs, this song is not as high up anymore as I put it in the beginning when it's when songs started to get released. Okay, so what do you guys think on the song from Slovenia? Do you think this is pretty cool or do you think this is nay, not so cool? Feel free to include your opinion of this song in the comments also if you have a certain point ranking in your head put that in the comments as well and with that said it is already now time to say goodbye i hope you had a wonderful weekend we're going to see each other back tomorrow but just the way it was already for the last weeks there's no reaction coming up tomorrow but if you're just interested in the reactions we are going to be back right here on tuesday when I will be reacting to the song from Spain. But until then, have a good one. See you there. Bye bye.